Hi guys! So I am in the McDonald's drive through line right now. It's super long. You know, Zaddy Ronald is my man and I have had to learn not to get jealous because everyone wants him. I'm at McDonald's because the new Little Mermaid Happy Meal came out. Now, I typically don't review Happy Meals because it's just like a new toy and like a new like fancy box, right? But I saw Little Mermaid last night and it was so incredible. Little Mermaid has always been my favorite favorite Disney movie ever and this version was just so magical. Halle Bailey is everything to me. Um, I am gonna talk more about it afterwards but basically I am gonna get multiple Happy Meals and I'm gonna unbox them, eat them. It's gonna be like a Happy Meal mukbang and I'm gonna open the toys and see which ones I get. It's just gonna be fun and you know these are like little like crappy toys but it's exciting because I want Ariel, I want Ursula, I want I want all the girlies, right? Anyways, it's time to order. Hello, thank you for choosing McDonald's. Would you like to use the mobile app today? Uh, no, thank you, the mobile app. Uh, I'm going to be ready for the order. Yes. Do you have the Little Mermaid Happy Meal? Yes, we do. Okay, perfect. Can I get four of those, um, two of them with the cheeseburger and then two of them with the four piece McNuggets. Uh, do you want apple juice and for the nuggets, barbecue sauce? Uh, barbecue sauce and ranch if that's possible. And then yes, um, apple juice also. Okay. And can I also get a large diet Coke? <clears throat> okay. And I think that's it. All right, next window. Perfect, thank you. My pleasure. <laughs> yes, I got four. I'm not gonna eat all of it, but it is a mukbang, so I have to get a lot of food, right? And I get four toys, so I'm so hyped. Hello, how are you? I'm good, and you? Good. Four Happy Meals? Yes. Yeah. 24.88. Okay. Yes, I see the one mermaid. I saw it and it was amazing it last nice night. Night. It was a pre-screening type thing. It was incredible. Oh, you because have to see it. I might wait though. Why? Until it calms down a little bit. Oh, I get you. Yeah, yeah. Because probably seen, like, there's a lot of people going right now. Yeah, I know. Probably going like in the end of June. Oh, perfect. When, when, when it calms down a little bit, because this is about to be crowded. Everything right. Crowded. It's like super crowded. It was fantastic. Uh, Bye. Have a good day. Good. I'm so awkward at like saying bye. I'm like bye just randomly. Um, I had to move forward though, but she was so nice. Oh my gosh, I love having like a good interaction. Queen. Yeah, so also um, I asked you guys some questions on Instagram and I'm gonna answer some of them. So it's a little kind of Happy Meal mukbang Q&A moment. It's gonna be fun, laid back, relaxed. And I'm just gonna eat a lot of cheeseburgers, a lot of McNuggets, a lot of fries. <laughs> This is like, okay, let's just be real. It's a very random video, but I just felt like doing it. I'm in a Little Mermaid vibe today. I'm the Little Mertim. <laughs> little Mertimmy. By the way, each of the Happy Meals were $5.39, okay. They come with apple slices, that's fun. Apple juice, it's an apple fest. And yeah, I'm just gonna like open the toys throughout so it's like little surprises throughout the video. It's gonna be a lot of fun. I'm ready. Hello, how are you? Thank you. Okay. Girl, we got a lot of apple juice. Okay. Four. I'm gonna save these in my fridge. That's for sure. Cause I got myself a soda. Hello. I used to never drink soda, and now I'm <laughs> obsessed. I drink it almost every day. It's really bad, guys. By the way, the Happy Meal box is stunning. It's like blue, and it has Hallie as Ariel on the box. Thank you. Okay. Thank you so much. Have a wonderful day. Okay, girlies. I didn't get the, the actual <laughs> Little Mermaid box. I got the Guardians of the Galaxy box, but I'm a Marvel fan. Okay, so the McDonald's parking lot was extremely squished. Squished? 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 So I'm now in some random parking lot, like in the back of some kind of a building. I don't even know, but my doors are locked, so it's totally fine. So, like I was saying, um, I did want the actual, like, Little Mermaid packaging. 
Instead, they give me the Guardians, but like I said, I'm a huge Marvel fan, and I love the Guardians of the Galaxy 3. That was an incredible movie. So I'm fine with this, just as long as the Ariel toy is in here. Okay. But I kind of wanted that pretty blue box in my thumbnail. <laughs> kind of sad about it. It's okay. It's okay. Okay. Let me get my thumbnail. I'm definitely going to put Hallie in the thumbnail somewhere here because she's so beautiful. Okay, let's open up the first Happy Meal. Oh, by the way, subscribe if you're new here and um, give this video a big thumbs up if you're enjoying it. It really helps me out for real. Let me get my uh, table. Um, and yes, my dog's carrying cases are in the back because I had to drop them off to get groomed. So we love that. I love it when my doggies are all clean and fresh. I love them so much. Okay, so let's open up the first one and see which toy we got. And let's eat. I'm so hungry. Okay. <gasps> I'm excited! Oh my god! Okay, apple slices, which I'm gonna save for later for sure. I'm not eating that right now, sorry. Oh, wait, oh my gosh. I see some action! I see some action! Okay, so I think that the options are Ariel, Ursula, Triton, Sebastian, Flounder, Scuttle, Prince Eric. Is that it? I think that's probably it. Um, okay, so we have the tiniest fry of all time. <laughs> It's legit iconic. Oh, wow. I'm gonna eat this in two bites. Mmm. Mint chocolate fries are it. Happy Meals are so magical. I just felt like buying tons of them. Honestly, as a kid, we didn't have a lot of money. So, I always got the dollar menu. I was rarely ever able to get the Happy Meals. Because they're like five bucks. Dollar menu is like two bucks, right? Well, if you get two items. And so... I just never got Happy Meals often, and now I can. So I did. <laughs> mm. Mm. No, the toy off. Okay, let's get the toy out. <laughs> so cute. Now listen, I'm only happy because I still have three more options. I better get one of the girlies. <gasps> Look at Sebastian, so cute. Everyone, like on Twitter, has been saying that he looks super creepy in the movie and they don't like his design, but girl, I saw the whole movie. He's hilarious, he's adorable, and you get used to it in like two seconds. I'm just so sick of people being so dramatic about a movie, saying this is ruining my childhood, all that stuff. Just so annoying, right? Cheeseburger! <laughs> Mm. Oh my god, there's nothing like a simple little McDonald's cheeseburger. Nothing like it. Mm. Mm. Before we get into the questions, I do want to talk a little bit more about the movie. So, there's also been tons of complaints about the CGI. Girl, The CGI isn't perfect. Listen, I'm an aerial stan, but I'm not delusional. Some of the CGI isn't perfect, and some of it does look a little floaty. Like, their like, heads are, like, floating on their bodies when they're underwater sometimes. But it's just a few shots that look weird. And if you let a little bit of bad at CGI ruin a whole movie for you, girl, you're not fun. I'm sorry. It's a fairy tale. Okay. Have fun with it. And I also want to talk about Hallie. Because ever since she got cast, it's been years now. There's been so much controversy over the fact that she's not white. And to me, that's just like the most insane concept ever. The fact that it's 2023 and some people are literally upset over a mermaid's skin color what's wrong with you like you're in the wrong era and i hate when people say i don't care that she's not white but 
this is my favorite childhood movie and I want her to look like Ariel. Girl, first of all, go watch the original if it upsets you that much. Second of all, have you seen Hallie's features? She, she literally looks like a cartoon character. She has these big expressive eyes. She is just literally a living princess, a living Disney princess. And I just think a lot of people are, are still ignorant to this day. And it's just upsetting. But all I know is that I watched the movie and no other girl could have done what Hallie did. Her voice is the most angelic thing I've ever heard. She's stunning. She's a great actress. She's everything. She's everything to me. Anyways, enough about the movie. Let's keep on eating. And let's get to some of those questions from Instagram. Okay, wait. Let's just first open up this one. Let's see. Okay. I'm just gonna find the toy. Apple slices. Get out of here, apple slices! Okay, who is it, who is it, who is it? Sebastian! No! Not two of the same one! Listen, I love this little crowd, but not that much. The face is super cute though, but... What does this do? It goes up and down? Oh, wait. Oh! There's like a wheel thing underneath. That's cute. Okay. <laughs> kind of pointless. <laughs> we have more fries. Uh, uh, uh. Not again. Okay. Mm, little four piece McNuggets. Oh my goodness. I love McNuggets so much. Let's break out the ranch and the barbecue. Okay. Okay. Oh yeah. Ooh. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So iconic. Mm -hmm. mm. So crispy. I was so hungry. It's past my lunch time. It's one. Girl. Okay. Let's answer some questions. Let's go to Insta. This is actually so funny because I did not say anything about this video being a Mc McDonald's mukbang, but someone asked a McDonald's question. <laughs> what would your McDonald's celebrity to me meal consist of? Mm, great question, queen. A Big Mac. Extra sauce. And an extra patty too, why not? If I'm a celebrity, I get what I want, girl. Hello. And then, large fries. A guava and cream pie, because I'm half Cuban. <laughs> and, mm, a large Diet Coke. Um, I think it's, I'm pretty simple. It would be a simple celebrity meal. But also, no, you know what? If I was a celebrity, I would ask them to make a whole new item, like a new sandwich. Because all these celebrity meals are so lazy. It's just the same old items thrown together. No, girl. I would be unique. I would make like a Big Mac quarter... Ooh. I would do like a Big Mac, but with quarter pounder patties. Oh, iconic. Okay, let's open up the next box. I'm nervous. Please don't be Sebastian again. Please. I'm begging. No! You're lying. No. No. no! I'm actually so upset about this. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. I don't even need seafood. I don't want that much crab. That is actually so annoying. We have some more nuggets, but I think I want a cheeseburger right now. Like another one. They're so good. Some more fries too. I'm eating so much. <laughs> I love it. If the fourth one is also Sebastian, I'm gonna be so upset. Why would they give me four the same character? Like why? And they were like, this grown man is buying four Happy Meals. Let's ruin his day. No, I'm just kidding. They didn't say that. Oh, God. No. 
Shut up. <laughs> my two fries. <laughs> Ranch. Mmm. Were you born in Miami or where are you originally from? Love your channel. Thank you. I was born in Miami and then we moved around a lot. We moved to New Mexico when I was two or three. And then we moved to Kenya when I was 11. And then we moved back to Florida when I was almost 13. So, Florida is where I started and where I currently am. But I do want to move. I stay here for like the climate and stuff, but I'm just getting scared. The negativity against the alphabet community is really starting to get to me. It's been upsetting me the past couple days. Like, now there's like a Target boycott. And it's like people are, are just getting mad at our existence. If you don't want to buy stuff with rainbows on it, don't buy it. But you don't have to boycott it either. I don't buy stuff with like trucks on it. I'm not into trucks. That actually made me like upset. I'm sorry. Let me talk about something else. It's just getting really bad, guys. And please just vote when it's time to vote. I'm begging you. Did you like being homeschooled? Well, that's that's all that I knew. I was homeschooled my whole life. So I'm, I didn't mind it. It was easier, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. Um, to be honest, like actual school always looked terrifying to me because in like movies you always see like students being mean to each other and all that stuff and I just always thought girl I have a stutter I would not make it in, in real school <laughs> at least that's always what I thought obviously I could do anything I want to do period but that always scared me let's open up the last one okay please don't be Sebastian please and I want my cheeseburger <laughs> where is it I don't want to look oh my gosh Apple slices! I'm scared, I'm scared. Well. Well, that's it. It's over. I spent $20 on this. Four of these. I'm gonna turn you into some Rangoon. Okay, let's let's get that cheeseburger out. I need it. I didn't get Ariel, Ursula, got four Krabby Patties, and that's it. I'm so, I'm actually so upset about it. Um. Mm. Let's read some more questions. Name your top five Disney movies. Perfect question for this. Oh my god. Little Mermaid. Moana. Frozen 2. Tangled. I love them all. Oh, Beauty and the Beast. Aladdin. Mm, Aladdin, oh, I never got that into it because the main character is a guy. I was always into, like, the princesses. And, like, Jasmine's in it, but she's, like, not the main character. <laughs> you know what I mean? Someone said... Ignore the haters. You are an amazing person and we support you. Thank you. So nice. Would you please try Arby's chicken salad? Girl, it looks so nasty. I don't think I can do it. It has grapes in it. I hate when like chicken salad or, or, or like tuna salad has like grapes or apples in it. I've never understood that whole concept. I never will. I can't do it. I'm sorry. Oh, also, like, Panera dropped this new lobster roll and a lobster mac and cheese, and I almost taste tested it, but then I was like, I don't think I can do it. Like, I physically can't do it. Will you admit that Hannah is your favorite sister? <laughs> That's actually one of my sisters, Hannah. Nar. I love all my sisters. Ah. <sighs> but I do love being the only man. <laughs> when are you going to do your next hotel mukbang? P.S. I love your videos. Thank you. Soon. 
the first one was so much fun and you guys gave it so much love so definitely soon i want to do marriott or um the hard rock hotel like the big guitar shaped one i want to do that but it's so pricey so i'm like oh i don't know um but yeah i can't wait who was your favorite disney princess a lot of princess questions i mean i love it. i'm not complaining but that's so random ariel and moana too um how has having your driver's license impacted your confidence girl it truly has i feel first of all less anxious because i'm like out of the house a lot more i feel like i can go anywhere at any time and just take care of myself and i just love it i love driving so much it's like my favorite thing i like need to drive every single day i need it would you like to do mukbangs in other places around the world i would love to but traveling is so expensive so so i feel like my channel would have to get to like a higher level so that i would be able to pay for that type of content before i actually make it you know so give this video a thumbs up <laughs> subscribe tell your friends um let it be at taco bell I just saw the new Chili Verde Fries Burrito, and I only trust your reviews. What? There's a new Taco Bell Burrito. I'm gonna check that out right after this, and I'll probably cover it next week if it is actually out. Oh my gosh. Are you gonna watch the new Haunted Mansion Disney movie coming out this year? Yes, it looks very cute. I love Disney World, I love the Haunted Mansion ride, and it looks good, so I, I will be watching it for sure. What's your favorite horror movie? Do you believe in the paranormal? The Conjuring, one of the scariest movies. I love it so much. It's such a good story. It has heart in it also. I love um, Lorraine, whatever her name is, and the husband. Do I believe in the paranormal? I don't know. I don't know. I'm very much the type of person that's like, I don't really believe in anything, but I also don't not believe in anything. Do you get I me? Mean? Like, I don't know what's real or what's not, so I'm not going to act like I know. Do you get me? Like, are ghosts real? Girl, I don't know. Oh, hopefully because that'll be cool are aliens real i think so to be honest like <laughs> there's just no way that in the whole galaxy we're the only people you know um what else yeah so i just i just don't know i don't know something that makes you upset and it's something that brings you joy Ooh, very interesting question well like i said in um the past couple days all of the anti-alphabet community stuff has been making me very upset but the stuff that brings me joy seeing people just be be themselves completely and just not care like guys everyone thinks that i'm always myself and i'm always slaying it blah, blah blah but i am terrified to hold alejandra's hand outside of the house and i i just have this fear of like someone just like coming at us you know what i mean and so people that that can do that and are brave enough to do that i have so much respect for them so people like that that makes me happy. And I wish that I could be that brave, but honestly, I'm just, I'm a very safety focused person. So we can really only show affection when we're inside or like a Disney world, we'll hold hands. Cause I feel like that's like a safe space, you know, but, um, anywhere else we don't hold hands, which is upsetting. But anyways, something that makes me happy holding on Hunter's hand, my family, my, my doggies. And like I said, just seeing people be themselves. That was heavy. <laughs> Do you have any trips or vacations for this summer? Love from Rhode Island. Yes, actually, um, me and my sister and our bays are gonna go to Disney World together. I'm so excited. And um, I'm gonna be visiting my other sister in Virginia um, later in the summer too. So I have two trips planned, I'm very excited. And of course, when I'm in Virginia, I'm gonna bring my camera and I'm gonna make content there. I'm gonna try places that we don't have here. So it's gonna be a lot of fun. Well, my camera overheated. <laughs> As per usual, I gotta find a new camera or something, but I love my camera. It's just, it, it just has a heating problem. Look at my massive vein, guys. It always pops out, I hate it. I'm insecure about it. Anyways. I have a lot of apple slices to save. I have some chicken nuggets left over, a lot of apple juice. I'm gonna take it all home, go and relax, go and edit this video, and all my Sebastians. Guys, I have four Sebastians. Thank you for asking all those questions. I'm sorry that I couldn't get to all of them. There were there were a lot more, but um, I just didn't have time and my camera got too hot. So <laughs> I will see you guys next video. Thank you for watching. Um, I love you so much. Oh, bye -bye.